Here's the thing. That, that's the, the, the super mind f- is when people get famous, like Jordan Peterson style. When they get famous when he they're He got older. hotter. He got great. higher, and then went loony well, bins. You know, what it is is he uh, he started eating only <laughs> little meat. Little bonkies. Little bonks. Yeah, he <laughs> got a little bonkies. <laughs> what do you think is bonker? What do you say that's bonkers? He's a little bonkies. I don't know. It just seems like famous, example. famous. Too famous? Entering rehab. Oh, but you know Pills. what that is? Yeah. He Pills. unfortunately did not know the side effects of benzodiazepines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sounds like an actor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Nicole Smith. The guy just took him. He'll tell you he took him because he, yeah. he was really struggling. But I think part of the reason why he's struggling is his wife was going through cancer. I thought he was supposed to be a smart guy. Read the label. I think you. <laughs> it's crazy. I think a lot of people. Advice on humanity. Listen, man. Read the label. If, if you did something. That, yeah. Like, uh, like if you do play golf, you play golf, yeah, right? I have, if I yeah. if I came to you, but I don't play. It. So if <laughs> yeah, I came yeah. to you, so what's the thing that you do that I don't do? Golf. Yeah. Okay. So if I came to you, and go. How do you do this? <laughs> yeah. I would just listen. Right. Because you do it and I don't do it. So if you're a doctor, a psychologist, you call your friend who's a psychiatrist and you say, I'm going through take this. These. What should I do? Take right. this. Don't right. worry. You you're going to feel way better. He takes Xanax. He feels way better. But he doesn't realize that there's a, one of two things that's commonly used that'll kill you yeah. if you just jump off it. One's alcohol. The other is benzo. Oh, what? no. Is that right? Yeah. He <laughs> alcohol? Got, if you're an alcoholic, if you're like a yeah. full-on, all-day drinking. And his drinking, doctor told him that? No, his yeah. doctor didn't tell him that. Oh, wow. So he didn't realize that until he tried to get off of him. And it mm. took like a fucking year, man. I that guy got no, those things. physically wrecked. Peterson rules, but yeah, anytime any of those intellectuals become get famous, famous, they kind of stink. They and then stink. And they're chasing when fame. you get fully sucked into the culture war as an intellectual, either side, I don't love it. Yeah, yeah, because then it's like you're wasting all your mental energy on the culture war and not, yes. not curing cancer or some like well, he was social thing. Cancer. But it's also to recognize <laughs> that if you don't fight against this shit, it just keeps pushing and gaining more boundary, more ground. True. It moves the goalposts. Yeah. It does. And you have to have yeah, really smart rule. people. He, he just you just have went to have a crying spree. You, you want a crying spree. Oh, but that's sorry about crying. your voice, the bro. Jimmy because Kimmel effect. he yeah. really yeah. feels yeah. that way. I know it seems crazy when you look at it out of context, but if you look at him crying in the context of the conversation it's because he really feels that i go on way. crying sprees but i keep him keep him off line don't yeah, record the thing is, don't like, he's he's not he's just being himself and he's uh, being himself in front of all these people in a three and, and he's being suit. himself with all these people yeah. watching he's him. being himself in a three piece yeah. suit it's, he's it's getting dressed up to go be himself and the weird three piece sometimes they're like multicolored like what are you but Batman he does that because he thinks that in, suits uh, he's cooler than he's, good. I live, yeah whatever it's like cool him. it's just the fame ruins a lot <laughs> of people's like, like work it definitely they're doing great work the Kimmel same sort of thing it's it like ah, you guys are all becoming something else but it's also because you're a part of a system right yeah. he's, it, Jordan's not necessarily a part of a system he's like removed from a system but then the problem becomes are you all constantly fighting that system or are you just sp- speaking about things the way you see them well the question is why is there a system fighting him why well, does why can't he just exist and yeah. talk about what he wants to talk about? Why is someone always too. coming it's down on him? Because he has all... a lot of influence. That's, That's what, what I'm it saying. Is. But yeah. why why can't he have an no, influence? And why do we the, have to attack him? It's because the internet. It's because who likes him? It's but, just people arguing on the internet. They're yeah. like Jordan Peterson rules. Listen to this quote. And then people that don't like the things you like are like he's actually a Nazi, <laughs> right? And then yeah. the people that like call him a Nazi, they're like you're gay. Right. It's just, there's no, I don't but know. But why, why do we have fuck. to be like this? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had something there. No, you did. But you did. Just well, Nazi has never been subjective But before. why do we have to be it's like that? It's a subjective term, right. which right. is weird. You're right.